what does that symbol mean? That symbol means... It probably means don't rob this place or you'll get your face smashed in. What's amazing me most about this is the bladder control. Because it's been about 15 hours. And un Must have scared him off. Okay, is he is he done? Okay, oh. Is it over? Oh. Yeah, I mean I've I've come in a few times, but they didn't look like they'd um taken a break. Yes, um, sorry, I was just, um, I heard the commotion and thought, ooh, that sounds like a really fun fight. And thought I'd come and walk, I'm leaving, I am leaving. Yes, I'm leaving, obviously, fun's over for the night, good night. We should do this again, that was a ton of fun. Yes, it was. Are you two not going to bed? Late night supper or something? Okay, well, yeah, I'm off. I'll, I'll I'll see you guys again sometime soon. Okay, it's been about an hour, so hopefully they are either asleep, drunk, or suffering from the effects of concussion. And I can now... Okay, I should have walked through those doors bold as brass. Just in case. Always best to walk through a door and look like you belong there. And then if there's no one around. Now I'm not totally sure it's a great idea to steal from these guys. They do look remarkably tough. However, I'm pretty damn sure if I do want to steal from these guys, I should do it after I've got my objectives sorted. Just in case the, uh, the next plan of action is leaving Whiterun in a hurry. And there is the distinct possibility that would be the plan if I do get caught. But they have got a lot of silverware here. Now, unfortunately, I only know one fence. We really do need to set up a network. Yes, we do. Because I've actually got more silverware than I could possibly sell. Yeah. Okay. Here we go, bold as brass. And if I do get caught act drunk. Okay. S Hello. So. This is. Okay. Is that him? Okay. I think this is him. I think. All right. Ah, this is Amethyst. Cushion, quicksilver, pronged, earrings. Nice. Okay. I don't think I want to pick pockets. I do not think I want to pick pockets on these guys anymore. Too risky. Way too risky. However, a little less risky to just rifle through their belongings. Quietly, obviously. Check. Oh. A 
Am I hearing someone wander around? I'm hearing someone wander around. Yes, I am. Okay. Right, both of those. You know what? Before I clear this place, let's figure out who's still awake. And, uh... Come up with a great excuse if we get caught. Is that a guy sitting? That's a guy sitting there. Yep, you know what? Let's clear this place out over here and get out of here. There was stuff upstairs to check as well. Yes, indeed. Stealing. <clears throat> Stealing a cape with the companion's insignia on would be a nice collector's <laughs> item. But it does mean if I get caught, I'm going to have a hard time explaining myself. It's not like I can say, you know, all this other stuff I brought with me. I was just... happened to be carrying a companion's cape. So why are my feet not taking me in that direction? I think Can he see me there? I'm not sure he can see me there. It's quite far, isn't it? I just how's he gonna see? Even if he does see me, he'll think it's one of his friends crawling around crawling around in a drunk stupor. I hope. I could, I could get a house made of silver at the moment. Okay, Song of the Return, don't have. Halgird's Tale. Okay. By Tavi Dromio. Uh, all right, fair enough. A book about a heavily armored person by the looks of things. Seriously, how am I carrying all this? Hmm, that pretty does sound nice. Killing before you're killed. It kind of looks like whoever wrote that book got killed in the process by Eduardo Corvus. I've seen many a man rushing... Okay. Some interesting advice then, right? I wonder if it explains why there's blood all over the cover. Maybe that's just artistic license. Could be, I guess. Ooh. A bunch of books. Ordinarily, I would say perhaps we should spend the night sleeping in the inn before we move on tomorrow. But seeing as I pretty much completely and utterly emptied the place of silverware, on my way. I think we should possibly move forward with the plans and uh, take an early trip back home. We're, we're, we're going to be going via Windhelm though. We have one thing to do in Windhelm, and we can do that on the way back to Riften. I just honestly really have a feeling the people I just visited are going to be somewhat interested in finding out who has all of their plates. Conveniently enough, the job we have here in Windhelm is actually to change the ledger in the stables, which means I don't even need to go in the city. We can just nip in here, change the numbers, and be on our way. Is that a guard? That's... That is a guard. Don't look suspicious. You're just calling on the stable master to... Okay, I 
don't think he's... Okay. Dude. Okay. Do not take too long. I will try my best. It depends how much stuff they've got in there. Yes, it does. Oh. Okay, I think we're good to go. So... Oh, close. I think that was it. Yes, right. Hopefully everybody is... asleep. Okay. There is... what we came for. He's asleep. He's asleep. Okay. Nice. <laughs> Another task out of the way. And uh, may even try. Uh... No, he is. He's, he's asleep. May even try to uh, rifle through. Hello. Uh, yes, rifle through some pockets whilst I'm here. Okay. Yellow book of riddles. Does this mean there's like other colours of books of riddles? Okay, we can check those out later, I guess. Okay, I think we're actually done then. All we need now is to check Arivanya and Ulandil. Okay, now, the value of these is more than the coins, but I've got to sell them at a fence, so I always make a big loss. All right, let's just do the coins. It's immediate. Pickpocket, we've got a pickpocket. No, you don't. No, you don't. You do not have a pickpocket. No pickpocket. No pickpocket here. It's a lie. Okay. Uh. In oh God, we're in trouble. Oh, no. In a go. Okay. Where are we going now? Where are we going? Uh. Where are we going now? Uh. We are going to get the hell out of here. That's where we're. Did we not get a bounty for that? Did we? We did. Nobody, nobody bloody noticed. Okay, excellent. The advantages. Need a ride? Of doing things outside of town. Where do you want to go? Uh, away, away. Yes, indeed. Climb and back, and we'll be off. Absolutely right. He was alive when we left. Okay, we we. Got in there, we changed the box, we left, and he was alive. And as what far as it? anyone knows, that's it. Yep, he was alive when we left. The fact that he died when he went outside sometime later, nothing to do with us. Nothing whatsoever. Yes, indeed. And in future, I might leave you a little further away so that uh, we have a few less accidents like that. I think we got away with it, though, because I don't think we actually got a bounty. Probably because he was outside of town. Okay, uh... I am here for you. I'm just curious. Do you have any thoughts? You just murdered somebody as they stepped out of their house, are you...? The market is closed, but there is still stock to be had if we are quiet. And quick. Oh, I love your thinking. If Excellent. If you need anything else, just ask. Okay, I'm just glad we're on the same wavelength, okay? So remember, he was alive when we left. Yes, indeed. We've got plenty of other good news for him anyway. He can't be annoyed with us. We've, uh, we've been doing some really, really good work. Yes, we have. We talked to Delvin first and tell him the good news about White Run. And then we'll just sort of slip in the other jobs later on, one at a time, and hopefully no one will even think to check. I mean, why would you really? You wouldn't. 
Okay. Still lots of jobs available. Interesting. Probably. However, um, okay, where, where was the other? Where was the? Don't I have to? T oh yeah, I finished the special white run job. Alfred sent ahead his compliments. Looks like his friend Arn is soon to be released, thanks to his brand new identity. More importantly, he's pledged the full support of the Battleborn clan to the Thieves Guild. Nice. I think you'll find that the guild is beginning to grow. We've had a merchant moving in a space right outside the flagon. It's really? Nice to shake off the cobwebs and get things rolling again. Excellent. But I can see a bounty headed our way. Nice. Okay. Um, well, I've also completed some other jobs. But before we do that, Who are you up to? I, I will. I'll be back. Give me a second. Mercer is being Mercer. If he has a plan to get us out of this rubble, then he isn't sharing it. We have a new. Cindus! Hello, Cindus! I've got all sorts of weapons for the discerning marksman. What can I get you? Okay, marksman. Well, let's just... If you're in the market for the finest bows money can buy, you're talking I'm not. to the right person. Then I'm talking to the wrong person. However, out Take of curiosity, look. and this is this is this is the thing that's going to decide whether or not I love you or hate you. Would you buy any of my stolen gear? No, really? Really? <sighs> Okay, well, I don't hate you, but I don't love you. Until next time. Mm, probably won't be a next time, I'm afraid. Oh, well, I, I might sell some of my legally acquired stuff to you, but honestly, why won't he buy pilfered wares? That is just annoying. Beautiful woman like you. Ever see yourself with an old codger like me? Uh, Absolutely. Did you need a torch? Because oh, really? that's a map. Well, then. How can we make that happen? Oh, you're you're talking to Vex? Now get out of my way. Bex, he's over here talking to Brynjolf. The only thing in your way is a bar. Okay, never mind. All eyes are on you, lad. Don't disappoint us. I, I won't. Any, any rumor you heard about some accident in Winhelm is a total lie. Total lie. Vex. Good news, I trust. Yes, I have completed four jobs for you. Here's your gold. Try not to spend it all in one place. Unlikely. Chulmil Nissian. Hmm. Okay. Tidings. Doesn't want to speak to me. Uh, you're the person I want to speak to anyway. Tanilia. If you're looking for extra work, talk to Vex or Delvin. I'll I will do. I've already up. spoke to Vex. I'm, I'll collect the rest of the tasks from Delvin soon. But I may I give have special rates to members of the Thieves Guild. Show me what you've got. I have got an awful lot of silverware. Okay, well, he bought some All stuff right. from me that wasn't stolen, so I'm a little richer, which, you know, can't be a Even bad thing, works, I guess. Where? All right, Delvin. All right, Delvin. What oh, is with that case of shadow banners you sold me? What do you mean? And why taste finer than anything really brothers ever made? Sure, it tastes great. Only one problem. You said it can make the darkness as clear as the day when you drink it. Guess what? It doesn't. But my responsible if the vintage was off on that case. Sorry, you know the rules, Nickel. No refunds. Okay, right. Uh, Delvin? I got another special request, and I specifically asked for you. You're making a name for yourself, that's for sure. But more important, you're making a name for the guild. Keep it up. And what is this special request? I need you to make your way to Solitude and talk to Erica. He's looking to run some kind of a shield job. Erica! Now, he's not exactly going to welcome you with open arms, but keep you cool. Do this job right, and we've just made an important friend out there. Okay, an important friend in Solitude. All right. Um, I do have some other jobs that uh, I uh, need to I collect on. I expect you to get paid for this blundered job. Oh. Next time, the mark stays alive. You hear me? All right, okay. All right, fine. <sighs> Should have known he'd hear about all it. Yeah, all right, all right. It's that not my fault, dude. It's not... Got lots of jobs available. <sighs> Interested? Yes, I've completed the numbers job. Good job. I'm now, seeing things with lights. Part of the deal. Right, and was was that it? Were there not other? Okay, I'm ready for some extra work. Before I'm going to give you any more work, 
You need to finish that job in solitude. Oh, all right then, all right. Can I give you a little tip? Take every job you can get, or else you'll end up a beggar. I was going to, you weren't giving me any. You, Don't disappoint us. Oh, all right, yes, right, fine. From now on, so, I will leave my bodyguard far, far away when I'm doing burglary jobs, because we don't want to accidentally kill the target. One of them came in and demanded payment. Bercy tried to tell them no. Stood up to them, but... Just when you think things couldn't get any worse. Bran Shea is out of jail. This means we get another chance to acquire his... You know what? Although I suspect we should probably not do it in broad daylight. Yeah, no, we're going to get seen, right? Well, we need to find out where he lives and pay him a visit. We do actually have a job here in Riften, but I think I'm going to wait on that. I have a mammoth tusk for this gentleman. Greetings, Arnold. And I have... Could I interest you in some fine jewellery? Possibly. Uh, I've already... Ivory from this tusk will be perfect for the inlay on my amulets. Okay, that is nice. 100 septins. That is actually more Safe than that tusk was worth. Strider. Okay, that is interesting. Now, they seem to be restocking the guild. Maybe it's our newfound success, but I've actually found another complete suit of thieves uh, guild items. Last time I only found boots and gloves, but I've actually found a full set. So it looks like they're going to keep getting new ones. Now, I know I promised I was going to give you this set, but what we're actually going to do is give it to him to improve. To today? And then we're going to give him purchase? the second set when that's ready and improve that. And then we will not only look awesome, we will be, we'll be better protected, which is always good. Can you temper my armor? Indeed. Now, I don't actually know how much this is going to cost. I've got 15,813 which is nice. Do you want to know the most annoying thing? I have a lot of silverware in my chest in the Thieves' Guild. A lot of silverware. And I can't sell it. We need some more fences. So I'm, I'm wondering if getting better contacts in the cities might unlock another fence somewhere. However, we'll just have to wait and see. Right, I want you to improve those four items. How much is it going to cost? Okay. Yes, do that. That's how much of an improvement. That's a reasonable improvement. Yes, it is. Oh, I could also do my orcish dagger, but then I don't have anything to take out with me. Yeah, I'll wait till I find a second one. Okay, and is that costing me anything now? Are we done? My original thought was to head back out and pick up yet another item for the museum in Solitude, then go to Solitude and do the jobs I have there, including the special task. I really do think I should prioritize those, actually. But this particular item is in a place called Ingvild. And I have a feeling this is a tomb of some sort. And I entered a tomb, or catacombs, or something in solitude, and the dead decided they did not like that and jumped out of their coffins and started waving swords at me. Well, at everyone else, actually. They, they, they seem to ignore me. It could be because I ran right back out of there like a sensible person. If the same thing occurs in Ingville it may end up being a bit of a wasted trip. I mean, we, we could just take the carriage to Dawnstar, trek around the coast, hop across... Oh, I really don't want to swim. Do you think we can find a canoe or something, or a raft? Well, whatever. Find a way to Ingville, and then sneak in and see if we can find the item in question, and then sneak out without entangling ourselves with any of the dead. That plan sounds ridiculously stupid. 
Let's go do it. Fresh leaves and I don't mind the snow. It's beautiful. Yes, it may be beautiful, but it's also cold and slippy and probably going to make our boots all mushy when we traipse around the coast. Captain... Everyone thinks I'm too young to be a ship's captain, but I'm going to prove them wrong. Okay, that's very nice. So this is Dawnstar. It's very quaint, I suppose. So we need to just... Okay, what's that? That is an apothecary. The mortar and pestle. Let's just check out this place before we carry the on. The mortar and pestle makes potions, if you can't tell from the name. Yes, just I... step up to the counter. Figured that. Interesting stock. No, I don't have anything for bad dreams, so don't ask. Uh, bad dreams? New in town? Oh, you're lucky. Dreams aren't affecting travelers. Everyone else, though. If you're not going They're to horrible. Mine, maybe you Imagine dying down. over and over again in your dreams. Night after night. They say okay. a priest of Mara is visiting the Wind Peak Inn. Says the Divines will take care of everything. Uh, we'll see about that. So this place is cursed? Okay. I will add that to the list of reasons to not be here anymore. Um, have you been in Dawnstar long? <laughs> I'm the oldest woman in Dawnstar. Was this here, I can was believe. Scald the elder, was scald the younger. He's a fool if you haven't met him already. Thinks Ulfric Stormcloak is invincible and spits dragonfire. The people here look to Brina Merilis when they need things settled. Real firebrand going up. Wasn't surprised when she joined the Legion. Oh. Okay. Uh, oh, that's so you're what I was. So you in my potions yes. and ingredients. That's mostly why I'm here, actually. Okay, absorption weapon, blessing. What on earth is that? Okay, uh, first of all, let's sell you some of the excess potions I have. Although, probably don't have too many. Well, it stopped snowing, which is good news. That should make the trek around the coast a little easier, although it does occur to me that what would make it even easier is a boat. Yes, indeed. Could we borrow this? Harl Laug? Looking to hire a boat? Hire? Yes, we can hire you. Would Where you? Where are you headed? It's a place called Ingville. Okay. All right. You'll take us to Solitude and Windhelm. Uh, no. All right. I'd pay you 50 gold just to take us around the coast a little. It would be well worth your time, really. I sometimes have a bad memory. Too much skooma back in the day. Forgive me if I sometimes repeat myself. Uh, you're forgiven. Um, you know what? Let's consider this good news anyway, because I did notice there was no carriage. The there was no carriage on the outskirts of town. Our carriage dropped us off, turned around and left. Can't say I blame him. So at least we now have a way back to solitude. The weather has improved, so that's more good news. And apparently, we're finding nightshade so I can make a few more potions. So, you know, all in all, it's good news. Are you hearing... Are you seeing that? That looks like, um, well, a door, I think. Looks like it's got a handle. Okay, in we go. We've got a somewhat terrifying looking door, I think. We should probably ignore it. Yes, we should. That would probably be the sensible decision. So feel free to tell me that moving closer to this would be a stupid thing to do. Just 
say, Leonard, you should probably not do that. I highly recommend you step away from the door right now and stop worrying about the nightshade. And under no circumstances should you touch the door. Inigo, feel free to drag me away and not let me touch the door. Um, the Inigo's listening to me? Uh, the one where you saw the lady in half being happily married dreams are real. Uh, yeah, no, the lady in half one. I've seen that. It, it's kind of impressive. You are not oh, please tell me that doesn't mean I'm going to be horribly murdered. No? Okay. Um. Uh, moving along. Yes, moving along and um oh get me out of here before i go back and poke it some more because there's something behind that door there is something behind that door yes there is you don't have a door that talks to you and makes a sound like that and doesn't have something cool behind it oh god seriously don't let me go just 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 okay We'll put it on our list of things to... In you go. I I'm not sure if you're an expert on wildlife in this neighbourhood, but are those large, blubbery, toothy things dangerous? I'm going to... Ooh. I'm going to say we should ignore them. I see a... Is that a fox? I was going to say wolf, but I think wolves are a little larger. I got a feeling that's where we're going. Hello? Okay, nobody here. I really, really need to remember to talk to the blacksmith and... Ooh, hello. Okay. Oh, no, no, I don't, I don't want to rest. I don't want to rest. No, no, sorry. I'm, I'm just, I'm taking stuff. Silver gun. Amulet of Mara. That is pretty valuable. Yes, it is. Nice. Okay, then. And lots of red mountain flowers. Yes. Lantern. Okay. I think we ignore the creepy-looking tower. Yes, we do. And we keep wandering around and try to find a way across to there that doesn't involve getting absolutely saturated. Oh, and that does remind me. I should probably put on my cloak. It does look a little chilly. And yes, I did forget to try and find you a cloak. I will, I will fix that. As soon as possible. We could probably wade across there, couldn't we? Although it doesn't look like that is... Con okay, there is a shipwreck there. Interesting. Very interesting. I am... Um, can we... Can we get from that island to... There, I suspect not. Not without getting soaking wet. It does look like there's rather a large gap. Okay. Thought I saw something moving. Yes, I'm pretty sure that's where we're going. Let's hope that there is a way to jump across over there, otherwise we're getting wet. And that water looks bloody freezing. Hmm. Okay. Let's pick up seashells while we're out here. We never know what they could be used for. Might be able to make some interesting poisons with those. Oh, good grief. I'm not 
Oh, I'm seeing, I'm seeing a wolf. I'm seeing a wolf and one of those. Okay, I, um, right. I seem to have taken that off my uh, list of things to have read. Oh, that's not what I wanted to. Do. That is what I wanted to do. Okay, spiky grass. Don't mind it. Okay, I think we can. We can make it across here, and let the wolf and the whatever the hell that is have fun together. Uh, I'm still not. Oh god, I don't think I can. I don't think I can make that jump. No, I don't. Okay. I think we have to go all the way around if we want to avoid swimming. Oh, a big, big, large, toothy thing creature. Let's ignore it. Let's make haste. Oh, God, we got a wolf. Because I think we can go all the way around there and get onto that island. Okay, this is... Oh, God, this is a big wolf! I think we have another one coming in. Okay. Oh, my God, these things are tough! Luckily for me, apparently you're tougher. That is... That is... That is good news. Yes, it is. Ice Wolf Pelf. Are these things... They're not really that valuable, but you know what? Maybe we can skin them and throw them over you if you start freezing to death. Uh. What a lovely day. Uh, if you mean the weather. Oh, hello. Yes, it is nice weather. But in many other ways, it's a horrible day because we're traipsing around a coastline trying not to get wet on our way to, let's face it, a disgustingly dirty tomb that may or may not have dead people who are less than ecstatic to see us. Generally speaking, when I try to, you know, judge a day, all of those things I would consider bad. I realise this makes me picky, but I'm okay with that. Can we do this? We can do this. We can do this. And, and we're getting some... Interesting components. Yes, we are. All right. Let's jump around on icy rocks. That sounds like such a sensible idea, but yes, there we go. See? A way was found that didn't involve freezing and or drowning, I think. All right. We're going to jump across the ice because we're... Okay. Now, I, 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 I may not... Oh. I may not be an expert, but I have a feeling those things are pretty damn dangerous. We might not be able to make this without taking a little bit of a swim. But... What we want to do is get us... Okay, seriously, dude, stop wading around in the water like you just don't care. And if you start waving your arms up, I will shoot you. I don't have a bow, so it may take some time. Oh, just, 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 just wade through it. Swim all you like. It's just, it's fine. I will go. Okay, you are a pretty good swimmer. I will give you that. Right. And, uh, you're mocking me now, aren't you? Yes. Okay, I'm coming. Okay. Uh, in you go. In you go. Now is definitely... I think we got... Cool. God. What a big kitty. Yes, a big bad kitty. Big bad kitty. Oh, God. We've also got a big bad... I don't know what the hell that is behind you, but I think it's about to introduce itself. Or, or not. Okay. It, it, Okay. 
it seems to be kind of friendly. Um, in you go. I, I think it likes you. Uh, that was a bad sound. That was my ins. Oh! Okay, no, it liked your sword. As soon as you put the sword away, it got really unhappy. That's fine. Introduce it to your sword some more. That went, that went weird. That's what that went. That went weird. Yes, indeed. Oh. Okay, is that an entry? Ah, yes. I... I have a feeling this is the way we're supposed to go. Yeah. We're heading into another dungeon, Inigo. So let, let's just take stock of everything I, I have. I have a torch. Yes, I do. I have a sword. I have a dagger. I have potions and I have poisons. Apparently, I have no sense of survival or common sense, but uh, perhaps that's not required. I can't believe I'm... Maybe we should ready our weapons, just in case. I like your thinking. Yes, I do. I do... Oh. Is it, is it a cave we got? It is. It's a cave we're going in. Uh, I know this is going to sound a little crazy, but I would just like to look around on the outside first. Just in case. Th think of it as a job. We're casing the place in case we need to leave in a hurry. And when I say in case we need to leave in a hurry, I really do mean when we need to leave in a hurry, because even if nothing happens and we get what we came for and all is well with the world, the instant we get what we came for, I will be leaving here in a hurry. Yes, I will. I'm desperately trying to convince myself that this will help me acquire the power and influence I desire. But I'm self-aware enough to realize that is just not true. There's a shiny thing in there that I want to get to give to another man who's obsessed with shiny things so that he will see fit to let me see all of his other shiny things. And even the realization of this is not going to stop me doing it. This is a serious character flaw, isn't it? It really is. It's going to get me killed. Or it's going to get you killed. I mean, that's also a distinct possibility. I hope you've realized that, Inigo. I mean, they say curiosity killed the cat. They may have forgotten to mention that was because the cat was following an idiot with an obsession for nice things. Although, what counts as a nice thing, of course, is subjective. I tell you what, I'm going to focus on um, not getting us killed for a while. Now, for all I know, this is actually just going to be a simple case of go in, find what we're looking for, and leave. But before I pull out the torch and start poking around in rubble, I'm just going to check to see if there's anybody or anything that might object to me doing that. There is a torch lit. That probably means there is somebody else here. Yes, indeed. What are you doing? <sighs> okay, come here. Come here. Come, come right here. <sighs> I will be here when you return. Very good. I will whistle for you. 
when I think I need you. Yes, I will. That is something it's bipedal and it's not wearing boots by the sounds of things. I say it. I have a horrible feeling it's not alive. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. I am with you. Did you yes, up oh, we seem to have Yeah, there you go. That oh. Dark Actual Yes, I'll do. Focus on me to go. Did that thing just shout at us and almost knock me over? Okay, let's worry about that later. Okay. Uh, ancient Nord Greatsword. That's bloody enormous. And not that. that. We have more. In a go. How are you feeling about uh, staying here? Because right now, running away is an option. I mean, this is just to get access to the museum, which is really silly. In it go. Kill it, kill it. In it go, kill it. Let us search them and move on. You think? You, you want to keep going? All right, I'm, I'm going to bow to your judgment here. And, of course hide behind you, constantly. As long as you're okay with that. Okay. Yes. I don't need my torch at the moment. I can't take these. Oh, no. I thought maybe that was uh, a wooden one. I think I've got enough torches. As long as I use them sparingly, they should not run out. And it does look like the uh, denizens of this place are Remarkably keen on light themselves. <gasps> it's probably so that they can see who's coming. I am. Um, I don't think poison's going to work on these guys. They do look very dead after all. And. I have a feeling pickpocket isn't going to be something that, uh... Okay. Has that one seen me? It might see you. Okay, that. Okay. In a, in a go, in a go. This one's got a thingy. This thing's got a spell in it. Oh, God. It's... Yeah, no, no, this is bad. In a go, this is... Oh, in a, in a go, in a go, this is ridiculously bad. Oh, actually, yes, no, in a go, running away, we're running away, we're running away, we're definitely running away. In a go, okay. In a go, oh, I've, I've, all right, you seem to have not understood the runaway plan. Okay. This is a go, I'm hitting a ghost, I'm hitting, I'm... I'm barely scratching a ghost. Oh, okay, I'm dying. Honestly, that's what you think's gonna happen. Yeah, you're probably right. Stupid idea. 